go. All right, four tax checklist. First thing I'll do is turn the generator on so we can get some airflow in the cockpit. I'm just going to hear us. Your breathe air comes to normal. You're going to turn your valve blower on, your air conditioner on. You're going to check your O-box. You check your anti-suffocation valve if you're breathing without the O-box. It's working. Turn it on. Check your max. Make sure you get a green light. Check your emergency in the field and the mask. If that's all working, you're good to go. You're going to breathe. You're going to say all normal with the blanker. And then we're spun uh, in the back. And you're going to walk back up. You're going to mess with your T-cast is what we're going to have here. So first thing you're going to do is turn it on. Avionics master switch is on. Skip that. Forget that. All right, so that's all booted up. You're going to test your T-cast. You're going to bring it down to range 5. You set it to above with this button on the stick right here. Above range 5, it's in testing. It looks good. Turn it back to your standby. Then you're going to walk across here. Make sure that your standby attitude indicator is uncased and adjusted. You're going to walk back here. and kind of flowing down across the cockpit. Check your G-suit. You check your flap. So, uncased and adjusted G-suit test good. It's one call and he'll respond to that. Then you're going to check your flaps and speed brake. Give the cruise chief the signal, bring the speed brake out, get a light, say speed brake lights on, he'll respond to the same thing. Then you go flaps to landing. Flaps come to landing. You can watch them come down and engage. Engage goes on my new crew chief will say that they're on landing. When we say flaps landing, lights out. We can respond to that. You go flaps to take off. They'll come up to take off. Flaps take off brake will not extend if we respond to that. Now you just walk up, you're gonna turn your trim aid on, ensure that your rudder trim comes back into the green. You're gonna set your GPS program that as you would like it to, and make sure your RMU is where you want it to be while you're doing that. Check your flash to make sure everything looks like it should, that you're not moving around your flash once everything's checking it. Set your altimeter. Say we're at two nine or nine or two right now. And then you've got one long call out. My flyer to check. I have two nine or nine or two sets. Why should I 600 over 600 on two? Um, my pin is in, my panel is clear. Check eyes is solo. I don't know if that's verbatim, but you have a long call out there. And uh, following that, you're ready to call ground and make your ground call, get your clearance to taxi. When you put the taxi, let's get you know by turning on the lights, moving the parking brake, telling you that you're ready to go, and you move out.